Good morning, Maryland. Watching some showers really move across areas around Virginia Beach and Richmond. A lot of this moisture is staying to our south. A few areas of drizzle are moving through northeast Maryland, and this is going to continue over the next couple of hours before we deal with the brief dry slot in the forecast throughout the rest of this morning. Temperatures are in the upper 60s to even the lower 70s. 70 degrees up in Elkton, Chestertown, and Essex. 69 in Stevensville and 66 degrees for everyone in Frederick County. So your pool planner is not looking terrible. We will be dealing with more clouds compared to yesterday, uh, but we will see some sunny breaks here and there, which will help our temperatures climb into the lower 80s heading into the afternoon. But it comes with a catch. We are going to be feeling more humid out there because our dew points will be climbing into the mid and upper 60s and looking to stay on the muggy side, very sticky tomorrow and Sunday, and then into that humid category for Monday as we head into early next week. We also have that chance of a few isolated showers and storms, which will mainly be set up right around the evening time frame after dinner time. So here is a look at a few showers that could still be lingering over the Delmarva Peninsula, primarily south and east of I-95, but there will be plenty of dry time today, so no need to cancel any plans. But a cold front will be approaching from the northwest, and this could spark a brief line of showers and thunderstorms as it builds in from northwest to southeast. But because it's going to be arriving around 8, 9 o'clock this evening, uh, a lot of that thunderstorm activity is not expected to be on the strong side, but we could encounter a brief isolated storm that could produce some gusty winds. Heading into the overnight hours, we look to dry things out. Saturday, we have high pressure building in, and that's going to leave us with a little bit more in the way of sunshine. So damaging wind and even